it'd be pretty interesting during this video, like you're making in an hour, bubbling your money while the market's open. So to be able to trade market data um, as well, but to me, how it works is in, 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 in a conclusion is when you find an opportunity that's current, develop an AI or having your AI where you just turn off the, uh, just turn off the, all the little profit guys, but just focus on the one big profitable strategy. And then, as I said, in my next simulation dashboard, I have to add in, okay, reallocate all that money that's been allocated, all that capital is reallocated to all these other assets and just focus them on this one, which in this case would be the ES. This is where we're going now. Uh, how it's looking right now, if I go here, uh, and I go back in the dashboard. So right now I have everything, well, everything running. So I guess it looks like it's added on since I started talking here. You can see this chart here. Um, it's gone up 38A. Is that right? That would be pretty interesting during this video. Like you're making in an hour, bubbling your money while the market's open. Okay. So something good has happened. And again, it's all simulated right now. Um, but, uh, yeah. So there's just some pretty wild stuff happening right now. But uh, I think this is a big winner if this is valid. And, oh, there I can turn off. But you see here I've, I've added in, I've, I've disabled the KC and just turn off all these other ones. But the problem is it does not mean that um, if I disable one, I'll have to put in my request and to the AI saying, if I disable one, please allocate what's allocated to it to the winning uh, assets that are that are making profit or the most profitable assets when I disable it. Um, so if this is very a very good uh, a very good simulator.